Welcome to Lebanon Turf Success Stories. Some of our customers would like to share with you their experiences with Declaration Keeping Bankgrass. My name is uh, Tim Birch. I'm the golf course superintendent here at St. Louis Country Club. This is a Charles Blair McDonald golf course built in 1914. It's got all the great characteristics of uh, Charles Blair McDonald uh, golf courses, all the feature greens uh, that he built on his golf courses, and uh, uh, it's been around here for a long time. We uh, renovated the golf course in, in 2008. Um, the uh, golf course being as old as it was had many grasses throughout it. Uh, St. Louis is famous for our mix of grasses and this one had them all from bent grass in the fairways. Some areas were Bermuda grass, uh, certainly tons and tons of POA, uh, some bluegrass areas. So it was a mix of everything and the club decided that they finally wanted to change to one grass. Uh, wanted to pick a nice improved grasses and see if they could eliminate the hodgepodge of grasses that were out here. The National Turf Grass Evaluation Program is probably where I got a lot of the information and, and got the most excited about the, the declaration. Um, and from there, I did talk to superintendents of other areas of the country that did have it for several years and, uh, and uh, took their excitement and, uh, and their belief in some of the NTEP study information on dollar spot resistance um, and aggressiveness, um, which is just what I was looking for here at St. Louis Country Club. The, uh, the little bit of bent grass I did have here before that dollar spot was my number one nemesis and so it was high on my list to try to find a grass that I wouldn't have to spend my summers, springs, summers and fall fighting dollar spot on my fairways um, along with the rest of the NTEP information that rated it quite high and uh, uh, it got me excited and so that's why I picked. Uh, up till now in the establishment of it uh, we've certainly probably pushed things a little bit harder with uh, the nitrogens, at least spot applications of nitrogen trying to fill in areas where, we, where we've been able to eliminate POA um, and uh, also fill in some of the shady areas on the edges of the fairways at certain seasons. But we're now kind of aiming a little bit towards, a little bit more towards a little lower fertility, seeing how little we can get by. It has great color naturally, so we're going to not push the nitrogen for color. Um, we're just going to try to keep it healthy enough that it can withstand the cart traffic and the, uh, tr the foot traffic that it gets. Um, yet not grow so fast that we're having to mow more than we'd like to keep the keep the practices to a minimum. Now that we have a good stand of uh, of one bent grass, it's uh, it's kind of exciting to uh, to actually be able to develop programs uh, around that grass. And certainly with this declaration, we feel that uh, we can do a lot to uh, uh, airify it and keep uh, keep it healthy. We're we're planning much more uh, verticutting. We've done some, but uh, this year we just don't think we can do too much of it. So we're going to try to sneak it in all we can. Um, and we've also adopted here at uh, St. Louis Country Club a, a sand top dressing program for the fairways, which we think will be a tremendous benefit uh, uh, to go along with the declaration to help keep our fairways firm and, and fast. And, and, and I think it's going to be a perfect combination, the uh, aggressiveness of the declaration that we've seen uh, combined with a continued sand top dressing program should, should make the fairway spectacular. Well, just as it was uh, as it was sold in the NTEP studies, uh, the dollar spot resistance has been incredible. We have we have yet to see any dollar spot on it, and and really have not made applications. Uh, we planned on doing it more as a uh, uh, a curative if we needed to, and we haven't had to. The members that are out here playing or just driving through are really excited about how how much more mature the grass is, how strong it feels to play on, to walk on, drive on. Um, in fact, their questions have gone to, can we get the rough perfect now? So uh, we're, we're happy, they're happy, uh, it should be a great year.